Welcome to NUR 507. My name is Patricia White and I have been on the faculty at Simmons College for the past 26 years. I am a practicing nurse practitioner in primary care and geriatrics and have my PhD from University of Rhode Island. I have taught in the NP clinical program as well as worked with masters and doctorate of nursing practice students in assisting them with their research projects. You will actually hear from two of the students I have worked with later in this course as they describe the process of developing their scholarly projects and report their results on two very important projects for the nurse practitioner profession. Hello, my name is Pat Rissmiller and I know some of you from Health Promotion. I am a practicing pediatric nurse practitioner for a community health agency and specialize in maternal child health. I also am a faculty consultant on a maternal child health funded grant at Children's Hospital here in Boston, which prepares leaders in the field of developmental disabilities. Like Pat, I also teach in the graduate FMP program as well as the DMP program. The FMP program has three core courses that make up the research sequence. 410 is the first one, followed by Scholarly Inquiry 1, this course, and Scholarly Inquiry 2, 508. In this course, 507, we build on the content that you have had in 410, and we will also do some review of that content. The major objective of this course is to have students identify a research problem and question, as well as implement an in-depth literature review on your topic of interest. Students can work in pairs, and you will develop a research proposal during this class. There is a potential menu of projects. This includes collaborating with an ongoing researcher or a research project in your practice, a quality or practice improvement project that your current facility might be interested in, an in-depth literature review that identifies the current state of the science, or in an evidence-based project. Students are also welcome to explore an original research project if it is feasible. Faculty are available to facilitate all of this work in each of your sections. The end goal of these two courses is that you have a research project that can be published or presented, and there will be more information about that in Scholarly Inquiry 2, NUR 508. We look forward to working with you in this course in facilitating this exciting process of working on a research project.